I'm out in Fort Lauderdale, Florida today to update this old sprinkler system to a smart irrigation system. And we're gonna do that by upgrading the controller to a smart controller, this indexing valve to electronic valves. We're gonna install a PVB, and we're also going to install a smart water meter that will tell the customer if they have a leak. All right, let's get started. All right, we got some dirt, we got some sand, some more dirt, and we got some pipes in the hole. So we're gonna go ahead and talk to the homeowner about removing this four inch pipe that looks like it used to go to an old AC unit. It's not being used for anything else right now, so it's just in our way. To top it off though, we also have this metal conduit traveling through here, so that we're gonna have to work around that. We're gonna try to put in the four valves and the meter between that footer and that metal conduit right in this hole. All right, got all that stuff out of my way. Now we rebuild. Because this main line is coming in at an angle, I had to install 390s so that I can correct that angle for when I install the smart meter right here. That's the next step. Let me go put the smart meter in now. The sun is slowly closing in on me, but until it does, we're gonna continue the job. We've got the meter installed and we've got the backflow installed. Next, we're gonna plumb down into the ground and put the valves in. Let's see what that looks like next. All right, we got one more fitting to go. That elbow right there and this will be done and we'll be able to wire it up backfill it and get all these blocks back in here so we can put in the controller all right let me get that done and show you what that looks like uh, sometimes it's a mess it'll be all cleaned up when we're done the wires are in we're ready for a valve box to be put on there a valve box to be put on there and a valve box to be put on there let's do that now